But today we're at the Garden of the Gods. Yes. Beautiful day. Beautiful. I can see why they call it the Garden of the Gods. Yeah. Um, it's up a pretty good elevation here in Colorado Springs. Yes. And um, no matter where you park, you're going to walk uphill. Oh yeah, you, you walk. <laughs> yeah, we tried this um, last Friday. Yeah. Didn't work out so well because it was just packed. And it's still packed. We're here on a Wednesday. We're like, let's go Wednesday. Packed. Packed. <laughs> um, so you can park at the base at the bottom and walk your way up. You got a good, at least a good mile or mile and a half before you even reach the first viewing point. Yeah. Now you can drive the loop and uh, there's little parking lots along the way, yeah. but they're small parking lots and they're all full. Yeah, they're like lookout points. You gotta wait for a spot. We uh, Luckily we got a spot at one of the parking areas, and uh, but it's not like you can go from one parking area to another and see different stuff. Once you get a spot... You need to keep that spot. That's your spot. Hoof it. Yeah. yeah. So um, we've already seen a little bit of wildlife. There's some mule deer out here. Yeah. Hopefully we'll get to see some more. And there's no possible way we're going to be able to show you everything here at the Garden of the Gods. No, because when you look at the map, there's like 17 or 18 points of interest that they mark for you of different rock, rock features. formations. Yeah. And there's no way it would take forever to walk the whole thing. Yeah. It's miles and miles of trail. So we're just going to highlight some key points based off of where we found a parking spot. <laughs> yeah. So we'll take you along and hopefully we'll get to see some of the coolest, coolest spots and yeah. uh, we'll show you. But if you get the chance to come out here to Garden of the Gods in Colorado Springs, definitely come. But I would say come during the week. And come at like 7 a.m. Yeah, and come because, early. Because <laughs> you won't get a parking spot. <laughs> All right, let's All right. go see some of cool. these cool rocks. Well, now we're headed down a trail to go see some more exciting stuff. The bad, the good news is we're going downhill. <laughs> the bad news is we may come, come back up this hill yeah. at some point. Be a thigh master for your butt, man. Yeah. Um, but supposedly there's some really cool rock formations this way. Mm -hmm. uh, we really didn't have a choice in which rock formations we got to see. The parking dictated that. Sure did. So wherever we got a spot, that's uh, that's, what we're that's all the stuff we're going to see that's <laughs> close by that parking space. And um, when we get done with this area, though, we will we will drive down and maybe we'll get lucky and get another parking space right, in another maybe. area. So we'll try. We'll let you know. This is Balanced Rock. Yes. One of the main attractions out here mm -hmm. at Garden of the Gods. So surprised we found a parking space over no here. No joke. Because it was like a Hail Mary when we left our parking space to come back over here. I was like, please, because we, we drove through here the, the last time. Yeah. And got a little footage of just driving through. But, you know, traffic, you can't just stop and take nope. pictures. And, and if there's not a parking space, it's one way all the way around here. Yeah, once you leave here, then you're exiting the park too. You miss it. I mean, you got to drive. Go back to the beginning. Miles <laughs> back around to just see if there's another parking space. Yeah. And so luckily there was one space, we jammed into it. So um, we're gonna explore around this little um, 
Bounce Bounce rock, rock area Whoa. and take some pictures. <laughs> <laughs> Well, now for the not so fun part. I'll hike back up. Walking back up the hill. Ooh. Bring your walking shoes. Hiking boots. Keep yeah. in mind the elevation, but it's amazing out here. Oh, yeah. It's amazing. It feels so tiny. I know. You feel so insignificant to what's out here. I feel like this big. <laughs> yeah. And this, uh, this is not even big mountains yet. No. Yeah. Well, we're, we're gonna head to bigger. Yeah. So, uh, definitely recommend Garden of the Gods if you pass through Colorado Springs. And, and we didn't know about it until Jerry from Happy Place Diaries yeah. told us about it. So once again, Jerry. Thank you. Good job. <laughs> yeah. So if you can find a parking space, yeah, <laughs> it's worth it out here. Oh uh, yeah. But just keep circling until you find a parking space. Don't give up. And mm. just uh, just be ready to do a lot of walking because. That's what it's going to require. Yeah. But uh, lots of places to stop and take a break if you need to. Mm -hmm. um, there's no food or water out here, so bring your own. Yep. And uh, you can tell as we're going uphill, I'm getting winded. So <laughs> I'm going to turn the camera off, but we're not done in Colorado Springs. Right. We're going to do a lot more. And today we're at the Pro Rodeo Hall of Fame in Colorado Springs, Colorado. N near and dear to my heart. Yes. Because, um, fun fact, I used to ride bulls <laughs> back in the day. That was a lifetime ago. For the army. Yeah. Not um, just for fun, just for the army. Yeah. Team. In Korea, they had um, what they called the Korean American Cowboy Association, and and soldiers could could ride bulls, travel around Korea, and entertaining other soldiers yeah. by uh, by traveling around and riding bulls and rodeos. So I got to do that for a little bit in Korea. Like I said, that was a lifetime ago. Uh, I think we have a picture. Yes, I do have a picture on my phone. This was before we all had cell phones and stuff. This was like. Uh, mid 90s, mid to late what, 90s. 19? Yeah. So we had like the, you know, the throwaway cameras where you like, you know? <laughs> yeah, it's so, a, it's um, a weird photo. We didn't take a lot of pictures, but I did have a buddy of mine take a picture of me one time to send to my parents. Yeah. Um, and that's me just getting tied in and getting ready to get yeah. turned out of the shoot, shoot gate. Yeah. Uh, so we'll put that picture up. It's pretty fun. To, <laughs> it is cute. <laughs> it's fun to look back on those times. It was fun riding bulls. I wasn't good at it, but it was fun to do. <laughs> so we're going to go into the Pro Rodeo Hall of Fame and we'll take you with us. All right. The inside was really cool. Yeah. Lots of cool stuff. Uh, a lot of history. I knew more about bull riding than anything else, yeah. but it was cool to see all the bronc riding, yeah. team roping, barrel racing, all that good stuff. Yeah. You can see a bunch of old uh, awards, saddles that were awarded, buckles, all that good stuff. Yeah, um, 
some of it was kind of hard to show because the glass the glares gave yeah. off bad reflections and stuff but now we're out in the garden yeah beautiful garden so lots of cool stuff out here statues and information and stuff so we'll take you around the garden but um on the inside um there was a couple of very cool stuff we talked about yeah. of course some of the most famous people in rodeo yeah you know um was it ty murray ty murray tough Hedeman. tough Hedeman, lane, lane frost, frost. People our generation yeah. would know. Uh, it was cool to see the yeah. display in there for for Chris Ledoux. Yes. Who was a uh, bronc rider? Oh, when we get back, because it's a circle. The whole thing is a circle. When we get back over there, there is a whole section dedicated to Chris Ledoux. Oh, cool. Yeah, so, so we'll see that too. That's gonna be awesome. It was really cool because when right before we got married, we yeah. saw Chris Ledoux in concert. Yeah. 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 That was uh. I just months before we got married. Yeah, I didn't even know him on the rodeo side. I only yeah. know him as the singer. Yeah, yeah so it's but a lot cool. of his songs talk about rodeo. Yeah, so that's why because yeah. he was a bronc rider. Yeah, and stuff. I had no idea his history. And his home state of Wyoming is which is where we are headed next. Yeah, it was very cool in there. I wanted to point out too was um, on one guy's uh, setup, he uh, he had a cowbell. It was all in and in. Now, if you ever held a cowbell in your hand, they're Good pretty job. solid. Yeah. This one's all dented in, so I'm assuming it got it's stepped on done. by a bull. So yeah. that just shows you the power uh, and the weight of these animals when they're stepping down. If he can smash that cowbell flat, yeah, that's uh, that's some power. It's a pretty hefty uh, yeah. pose. Okay. Let's go see the garden. All right. and I found a rabbit. thing ever. It's the, it's the cutest and the sweetest and the most precious thing ever. Come out and walk around. <laughs> These two deer walk around the statue. I don't know where they came from. We're in, we're in the middle of Colorado Springs, well, man. Keep, I mean, there's railroad tracks here, so they came somewhere from down in the valley. But Walking up there, just eating off the tree back there, <laughs> hanging out. Don't bother us at all. They are adorable. <laughs> I want one. <laughs> so if you come to the Pro Rodeo Hall of Fame, you might see deer just walking around the parking lot. Look at this thing. It's so beautiful. <laughs> Love it. Oh, it's a good time here, though. I, like, I want to go hug it. Like, I, want, I don't think I, he'll let you hug I, it. I don't think he will either. <laughs> but I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't try to hug it. So how are you liking Colorado so far? Loving it. Yeah? Yes. We uh, we have done so much in Colorado that we're going to have to split it into a couple of videos. Yeah. <laughs> and we didn't even... Like, do half the things on no, the list. No, we're definitely going to have to come back to Colorado Springs because there's just so much to do. Time. And, you know, we're here for two weeks, but not really because most of the activities are outdoors. Yeah. So anytime that there's bad weather, you really are stuck not being able to explore too much. Yeah. There's a couple of indoor activities, like the Pro Rodeo Hall of Fame that we yeah. did, uh, which is really cool. But a lot of the other stuff is outdoor It's activities. mostly outdoor stuff. Yeah. yeah. So we hope you enjoyed watching the Garden of the Gods mm -hmm. and the Pro Rodeo Hall of Fame. Lots more to come yes. in Colorado Springs. Mm -hmm. So that's coming up next week. Yeah. Because like I said, we just had so Too much, much. Mm -hmm. and split it into. 
Right, like we do at the end of all of our videos, we're going to honor a fallen hero. Mm -hmm. If you want to get involved with us helping veterans out on the road, everything you need to know is down here in the description below. Yep. More Colorado Springs to come next week. Mm -hmm. Appreciate you watching. See you next time. Bye.